Hello YouTubers, uh, today what I wanted to show you, I wanted to show you how to bulk convert documents in your drive. Now whether it be a Word document, in an Excel, or a PowerPoint, there is an easy, convenient way to do it. So first off, I'm just going to upload a few documents. And the whole reason why I'm making this video is uh, yesterday a teacher came up to me and she said, Nick, there has to be a better way to do this. I've been spending three hours uploading my Word documents into my drive and then converting everyone individually. So what she would do, she'd click on it, she'd right click, she'd go to open with Google Docs and then it would create a Google Doc for her but then she'd have a duplicate of it. So now I'm going to show you the easier way to do it. Now right now I'm working in the new drive. So in the new drive you click on your settings and then you're going to get this pop-up. Put the little check mark here, convert uploaded files to Google Docs editor format, which means any time that you upload something into your drive now, it'll convert itself automatically to the Google Drive equivalent to it. Now, if you are still using the old drive, I'd suggest you go to the new one, but uh, if you're not comfortable with that, I'll just show you how to get to it in the old drive as well. So here my option would be clicking on, uh, on the gear and then upload settings, and I'd want to make sure that the check mark is here. Now, if you're telling me, Nick, my goodness, I already uploaded all my documents into the drive and I deleted them off my desktop. So how the heck am I supposed to do this for all new uploads? Well, the most convenient way to do that would just be to create a new folder and you can call it Word, you can call it whatever you'd like. So I'll create that and then I'll take my, my Word documents that haven't yet be, been converted. Let's see if I can select both of those drag them into my Word folder. And then here I'll right click and I'll download it. So now I'm downloading the entire folder with my two files inside and now I have my zip. So if I open my downloaded files, I can either upload the files individually, just dragging and dropping, or I can do the whole folder. Um, simply by dragging and dropping the word. I'm just going to double check here very quickly to make sure that uh, my settings are actually on for converting those documents. Settings, convert is on. We'll go into the finder and I'm just going to drag and drop this word right here. Incoming, and you can see one of two. And voila, both uploaded. So now if I check my Word, oh, I'm not sure which one it is that's converted or not. So those ones still have W, so those ones are still my Word documents. And this one here has my converted documents. Easy as that. If you guys have any other questions, uh, let me know. Feel, please feel free to check out any of the other videos and uh, subscribe if you like it.